Hey guys, this is Corey with Custom RV in Amarillo, Texas again. And today I have our fourth Sunset Park to show you. This is the 2022 Sunlight Model 18RD. This is a little bit bigger than the 16BH that we have another video on, which is this yellow one over here on the, that you see on your right side of your screen. But this one still comes in about 2,480 pounds and is going to be about 18 feet in overall length. We're going to do an interior and exterior walk around video tour today, show you some of the cool features on this compact off the grid style camper. Let's go ahead, we'll jump onto the inside and take a look at that. Okay guys, so we're up inside this 18RD by Sunset Park. And as you can see, this one is a little different than the 16BH. So this particular one has the Murphy bed. You can also get this with a fixed queen size bed. We chose to go with the Murphy bed because uh, you've got a couch as well as a dinette. And we'll stock some 18RDs and we actually we have some ordered that don't have the Murphy bed. Um, but I would figure I would give you a chance to take a look at this. So this is also in the ash interior decor. So it's a little bit darker, a little bit more modern than the Naughty Pine option. Personally, I would go with the Naughty Pine. I think it just looks great. But anyways, so you have a nice sofa right here. And this will drop down and the bed will flop over on top of it. In this one, you also get a power vent fan up here as well. You don't get this in the uh, 16BH. You're also, or there also is a bunk option available. Um, we'll have some of those coming in as well. Over here you've got your entertainment center. So if you want to add a TV, this is where it would go. Um, personally, I would put that on a swing arm mount, but you've got all your connections and your backers over there. Pretty good window coverage here. So you've got uh, cross breeze windows on both sides of the bed. Both of them do open. And then, let's see, I actually want to go this way. If we take a look over here, you do have a two person dinette. So this will drop down into an extra sleeper if you need it to. And I'm, I apologize for that sun glare. That is just, that is awful. Um, and then, of course, you're going to have your kitchen space over here. We'll come back to that here in just a minute. Over here, you are going to have your AM, FM, and Bluetooth stereo system. This will control the interior and exterior speakers and has, uh, I believe, HDMI and USB ports. And then, if we look up top here, you, this does have a full-size roof air conditioner, so 13,500 BTUs instead of a side mount air conditioner that a lot of trailers this size are using. And then over here, you're going to have some, uh, some of your controls. So you've got some lighting controls. Here's your tank monitoring panel. You've got dual awnings on this one. You're also going to have your water pump, water heater on gas and electric, some extra lighting controls. And then right here is going to be the 100-watt solar charge controller so this will keep the solar panels from cooking your battery and then right inside the door this is very reminiscent of a truck camper so you have a pretty good size dry bath and what I mean by dry bath is the toilet is not in the shower no sink in here but I'm okay with that given the weight of this camper good leg room around the toilet and then if we come in here, you notice this is a pretty good size shower. ABS plastic uh, surround paneling there. And you can be upwards of 6'3", 6'4", and still shower in here because of the skylight. Really good placement of that skylight too. And then you do have another power vent fan up here as well. All LED lighting too, by the way. So alright guys, that is going to wrap it up for the interior. Let's go ahead, open up all this storage. And take a look at that as well as the kitchen because i tell you for such a small camper this has a pretty good amount of storage so all right guys as you can see up here above the bed you do have a nice chunk of overhead storage remember there is a bunk option available as well over here you are going to have hanging closets on both sides of the bed and there are household usb outlets uh over there on those little nightstands or around those little nightstands as well 
As we come over here into the kitchen, you'll notice we've optioned in the three burner stove top with the oven. Now uh, this does have the glass stove top cover for some extra prep space. Handry, ha Handry, handy electrical outlet right there too. Nice dual basin sink. Uh, there is a sink cover option available. We just did not get that on this one. You could always make one if you're a little bit handy. High rise faucet up there too, by the way. You've got your microwave up top, as well as the hood range, and then a good chunk of storage up there, like the little electrical outlet for the microwave. That's so handy. If we drop down underneath the countertop, you've got access to your water heater. That it just makes it so much easier to get to. A handy drawer. No kitchen is complete without a drawer. If we come over here, you are going to have a nice chunk of storage. Plumbing access there as well. There is storage under the dinette, uh, provided that you move the cushions. I have not done that today, um, but there is storage under there. And then you've got storage up above the dinette as well, which is a very nice touch. Rounding out the back here, you do have an 11 cubic foot, 12 volt compressor driven refrigerator. So the cool thing with this is you can actually run this while going down the road. Apparently we're not level. <laughs> I'm trying to juggle both these doors here. Um, but you can actually run this going down the road. You can't do that with a gas electric fridge. There is a gas electric option if you want. Um, but this also gives you more cold storage. And I think a lot of people are really going to like that. So all right, guys. That's going to wrap it up for the interior of the 2022 Sunlight Model 18RD. Let's go ahead now, we'll jump onto the outside, take a quick tour around there and show you some of the cool features. Let's go take a look. All right guys, so we're on the outside of this brand new Sunlight Model 18RD. So as you can see, this is a stick and tin aluminum sided trailer. Up here you've got a nice power tongue jack. That is an option, you can get this without that if you wanna save a little bit of money, but I think most people are gonna want the power tongue jack. Dual propane cans is a very nice touch. I really like that. And then you've got your rails for your battery back over there. We're going to start on the off camp side of the trailer and then we'll uh, take a look at the other side here in just a minute. You are going to have four corner stabilizer jacks that are manual. And then if we look in here, you've got a nice chunk of pass through storage in here. Uh, really good size for such a small trailer and then right here you're gonna have your fresh water inlet right there as we come back along this side and apologize for the wind noise you got your six gallon gas and electric hot water heater that is an option you can get this with just a gas water heater as well good looking wheels and tire package um, I absolutely love that you're gonna have your cable outlet Black tank flush, city water connection, and an outside shower as well. Black tank flush is technically an option. And just so I don't trip over that cord, because we've got these daisy chained together, I'm going to back up and go around this way. On this side of the trailer, you do have your first of two power awnings that does have LED light strips in it as well. You're going to have an electrical outlet, dual outside speakers, you're also going to have a handy propane quick connect down there as well if you want to add a barbecue grill. Finishing up on the back, you have the optional rear awning that does have LED lights in it. You're going to have a porch light door there as well. Uh, this is a really unconventional floor plan. It's more like a truck camper than anything. And then you're going to have your 30 amp service here, spare tire, spare tire carrier, bumper for your stinky slinky. And then you're going to have a dual step Moride step above steps to help you get in and out of this camper. So all right guys, that's going to wrap it up for the 2022 Sunlight Model 18 RD. If you're interested in this travel trailer, you have any questions or if you'd like pricing and availability, uh, I'll leave a link to our website where you can check pricing down in the description box below. You can also give me a call at 806-335-2336 or you can send me an email at contact at custom-rv.com. 
As always, guys, we thank you very much for watching. If you could do me a favor, hit that like button down below. That helps us uh, with the YouTube algorithm, and we would greatly appreciate it. Also, please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell down below. That'll help you keep up to date with all of our new videos. As always, guys, again, we thank you very much for watching. Remember at Custom RV, we don't do any hidden dealer fees. We leave that up to the big dealers. And we know that RVs are made for women, so men can go camping. All right, guys, we thank you again very much for watching. We hope that you enjoyed. We'll talk to you again very soon, and have a wonderful rest of your day.